Well, my name is Kenneth James Johnson. I'm a tech sergeant in the United States Air Force. I'm a medical lab technician, so I worked in a hospital. Um, most people are familiar with us drawing blood, but we're pretty much behind the scenes and we run a battery of lab tests for physicians. Yes, I was a professional dancer, yes. Um, so break dancing, uh, jazz, ballet, um, pretty much all of it uh, I've done. I, I couldn't get into a physician type program uh, I was looking at psychology, but I didn't have all the prerequisites, uh, so I was kind of bummed out. And one of the guys who had came into my unit, uh, Staff Sergeant Cass Vaughn, told me that there was a new program that they were trying to get enlisted people uh, to med school. So I told him, I was like, no, nah, that's not true. I was like, I've pretty much seen it all. And he's like, yeah, it's on the Knowledge Exchange, something like that. I said, no, it's not. So he said, let's go to your office. So I went to my office, and I pulled it up. And when I seen it, I almost passed out. And when I came to and figured out that it wasn't just a, some kind of a ugly joke, I started trying to get everything necessary to apply for it. This is kind of like coming full circle. So when I was coming out of high school, um, this was something I was going to pursue. Even as a child, I, I remember telling my grandma I'm going to go on mission trips to you know, different parts of Central America and, and help out as a physician. Yes, I'm married. Um, my wife is military. Uh, her name is Lacey Johnson. She's tech sergeant. She's also a medical lab technician. Um, we have two kids. I remember I told her that I was going to get out of the Air Force and I was going to go to medical school. Uh, and she was like, um, I don't think that's a possibility. So when she found out about this program too, she was very excited. Now that I've got it, she's, she's just ecstatic that, that we got this opportunity. Having the chance to go to medical school is something that not a lot of people do. Then having the chance to go to medical school and get paid to do it is, is something that a lot of people don't get to do. However, being an enlisted member, continuing your service, so having nine years in and being able to continue my service without getting out is very, it, it's unbelievable.